everybody, welcome back. I'm heading over to my parents' house shortly. My, my mom calls this morning and says, we're gonna paint our living room. All right, well, you know, my dad just had his 80th birthday party and my mom, you know, they're not gonna capable, they're capable, but you know what I'm talking about. Well, she said, we're gonna hire somebody to paint it and it's gonna be like a little bit over $500 to paint their living room. And I said, whoa, 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 stop, stop, why? I, my husband, Rob and I, my husband and I, we'll, we'll paint it for you. You know, mothers are like, well, I don't want you to have to. Well, I don't want you to spend that much money to get your living room painted when you have children that are perfectly capable of doing it. You know, as your parents age, it's our job to take it's our job to take care of them, and this is just one way we're gonna take care of them. So I have all these paint samples. Listen, I've got a lot of paint samples. Over the years, I've painted a lot, different colors. I've got a, a bag, bags, look. I, I'm not kidding you. I have a lot of paint samples here. Mm. I just collected them whenever I, I just never threw them away whenever I, through the years, wanted to paint something. So, I don't know, I've just saved them. And with modern technology now, they could match the color. So I thought, why not, I'll, I'll save them. I don't know, I think I'm done painting this house colors. There ought to be something I could do with all of those paint samples. All right, my closet. I showed you my table last time. I've got my little sewing table set up. All right, and then if you watch my Walmart vlog, I bought a mirror because I thought I am gonna sit in here and um, do my hair and makeup. So I'm starting the process of kind of setting that up. But, and we've gotta make a little couple tweaks because I can't sit in that chair. That chair is just too hard for me to sit in and it hurts my back. So I, uh, that has to change. And my mirror needs to be a little bit higher. But other than that, that is working. I am. Uh, I sat down to dry my hair today because I I don't know if I have the rod in my spine and if I look at my neck, I've had actually two neck fusions. They went through the same hole twice. It's just easier for me to sit down and do things. I sat down to dry my hair today and it was like a big relief. Uh, boy, did that feel good. So anybody out there that gets tired drying their hair and putting their makeup on and I don't know. Find somewhere to sit down and do it. It's a huge difference. We have our first winter weather advisory of the season. It's gonna snow tonight. Snow and ice and all that good stuff. Oh, tomorrow I'm supposed to have my granddaughter, but my daughter lives a little bit of ways. She has a babysitter in her area because on those in case moments that Gma can't do it, she goes to the babysitter that's closer to her house. So tomorrow she's going to the babysitter because it's supposed to be really bad weather tonight, which is okay with me because a break once in a while is nice. We are getting her Saturday night though. She's going to spend some time with us Saturday night, but I do enjoy having her. It's like having her is like when my, when my daughter was young, it, it's just like having my daughter. So it's, it's just fun for me to keep her because she's like my, my little buddy and it reminds me of when my daughter was a baby. Also, I made a video about Trikafta a week or so ago and in that video I mentioned um, another vlogger. Her name's Jillian Azzarelli. Well, she has to have kidney transplant now and pancreas and she's having a really hard time right now I'm gonna link their channel in my description she's gonna be vlogging the experience of having a transplant so I don't know if you want to hop over there and subscribe to their channel but and pray for them because you know that's it's whoa sorry you're back but pray for them because, you know, that's some pretty incredible news to get. And um, they need our prayers. 
look in my description and down there will be my video on Trikafta and a link to Jillian's channel. Alright, I'm at my mom and dad's house and we're, we're picking out the paint. She bought this picture. It's really pretty. It's a pretty picture. And she wants to match her living room somewhat to this picture. The crazy way to do it, I know, but that's the way it is today. This time. She's like in the, the kind of brown grays. I don't know. This is a really pretty picture. She matched her husband with the chair she has in her living room. <laughs> she matched you with the chair? <laughs> Pretty much. Oh, my parents are funny. Oh, there's our out pile over there. She just tossed them. Show your pile. I know. I showed them my pile of all my paint. I should. I wonder if I could donate these to, like, a Bible school or something. I don't know. I have a lot of them. I lost the one we like. She. Oh, jeez. All right. She lost the one we like. Is it this one? No. no. It's this one. What's the name of that? She had. She couldn't read the paint swatch, so she handed it to me because she didn't have her glasses on, and it's like I don't. I can't read it either. I don't know. Which one is it? Real <laughs> See? Look at us. Realist beige. I think we're going to go with that color. She doesn't have her glasses on, should we tell you. Doesn't have her glasses on because they have the, the tint that gets dark. And we're sitting in front of the window and her glasses are dark. So she can't see anything. All the colors look brown to her. They just watched my video where my husband and I went hunting and they were rolling laughing. Go watch the video. It is pretty funny. I will, uh, I'll link that at the end. All right, this is a thing. So she's got the, the picture, but look at the furniture. The furniture is gold. It's brown. That's gold. It doesn't go yet. It doesn't go with the paint, so yeah. you know what that's going to mean? She said yet. It doesn't go with the paint yet, so I see furniture shopping in the future. I figured that would happen. The carpet's good. Their carpet is like grass. Let me show you. It's like shaggy grass. In fact, one of my nieces said, "What did? What did? who said it? Isabella or Olivia? Oh, she walked in and said, Oh, grass! It looked like grass. When it was brand new, it looked like grass. I mean, not like green, green grass, but the texture looked like grass. My niece started a petition, her and a couple of her friends at school, because of the coronavirus, they were wanted the school to be shut down for a day and have the school sanitized because of this virus. Well, Instead, what happened was the school read her petition and now they have a hand sanitizer mounted on all the walls in every classroom and when each class is done, the teacher hands out wipes and every kid is supposed to wipe off their desk chair area. So I thought that was really nice. The, the school actually listened to them and uh, did something about it. I mean, they didn't shut the school down for a day, but they ended up mounting hand sanitizers and taking care of, trying to take care of germy situations. And I thought that was really nice. We picked out the paint and uh, she's gonna see if she likes it in the dark and then go buy the paint and my husband and I are gonna go paint for her. I like to do trim work. I'm pretty good at doing trim work. Um, and my husband will do the rolling part. I'm, I'm not, I can't do that part. I can sit and trim and trim around the windows and stuff, but not rolling. I can't do anything over top of my head, so that's totally out. But on that note, we will see you next time, or I will see you next time. Bye.